after all the new software updates available for the Galaxy Watch, the Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 1 and the Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2, we are super interested to see what improvements these software updates bring. In particular, we're interested in the heart rate, calories, yep. distance and anything to do with the fitness tracking functionality. Here's how we've done it. We have a set course of 500 meters. Tony's run that, me, I've run that, and we took every single watch, me on the left hand side, you on the right hand side, to really replicate a real environment. So we have a male, a female, and we try to be as accurate as possible. We also run with every single watch one course. So it's like six runs we've done, and we want to have really good results without having a laboratory. We also have a Polar B chest strap on us to really compare that. And guys, we really, really encourage you to watch the entire video because during the video, you will see that there are really major glitches coming up, and you kind of make your mind up already but you shouldn't because everything every single thing is going to be turned upside down at the end which we didn't expect galaxy watch The Galaxy Watch comes in with 42 mil as well as 46 mil and is available for around 215 US dollars. Okay, 500 meter first check. We have a heart rate of 150 on the Galaxy Watch and the chest strap itself 156 compared to 150. So far, so good. So 500 meters with the Galaxy Watch and on the Polar Beats we have a heart rate of 162 and. And we have a heart rate of 160. Galaxy Watch Active. One. The original Galaxy Watch Active comes in with only one size 40 mil and is available for 150 US dollars. Galaxy Watch Active one has 161 polar beat, 159. Needless to say that we look at the calories and distance and everything else like step counts later hey girlfriend so galaxy watch active one on the active one i have a heart rate of 122 yet on the polar beat i have 165 so that's the difference a whopping difference of 40. Don't be fooled by the results. Stay around till the end. It does change. Last but not least, Galaxy Watch Active number two. In workout. Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2 comes in at two sizes, 40 mil and 44 mil. You can get it already. Starting price for 250 US dollars. Also worth mentioning that the Galaxy Watch Active 2 has different versions like the Under Armour Golf Edition and many more. Galaxy Watch Active 2, here are the results. And I noticed that this is the only one out of three that where the heart rate really goes up and down and i don't know why we had this before so let's have a look the galaxy watch active 2 has 154 and it jumps up to 165 obviously when i show you that then it doesn't but it just did and the polar beat let's have a quick look has 155 also 153 that everything is aligned really the only difference i notice is that the active 2 jumps up and down with the heart rate and as I said, we had this in many videos before. So Active 2 now, I did check along the way because I know Jens has some troughs and some highs as he was running. Mine was a pretty constant. I went from 164 all the way up to 175 and it was in line. I'm now slowing down, obviously. The Polar Beat has 167 and we have 167 on the Active 2 too. <laughs> Before we move on to the results if you find value in our videos don't forget to like and subscribe here we go guys on the left hand side you have distance calories heart rate on top you will see my picture you will see tony's pictures below you will see the galaxy watch active one and active two next to that you will see the polar beat and you move down you will see data for each device so stick with me here when you uh, look at the active one for Tony, that was a major glitch. And I don't know what happened there, but there is some really, some odd things going on. Um, overall, it's all different results apart from one single watch. And that is the Galaxy Watch Active 2. If you look at that right column on my side and the right column on Tony's side, you see the data almost matches the data 
with the Polar Beat. Look at the heart rate. My heart rate for the Active Tools 150. The Polar Beat is 149. Only one off. Tony 163, 164 for the Polar Beat. Also only one off. The calories almost match. A bit slightly off in the distance, but overall, the software update really does wonders here. You probably noticed that the ECG and fall detection feature is not out yet. That was promised by Samsung in Q1 this year. So that has passed, right? Samsung has published a statement about a couple of days ago that mentions that the fall detection and ECG feature will not come to the Active 2, Galaxy Watch Active 2, just yet. It isn't stable enough and the FDA is pushing back. However, we are really looking forward to it to be implemented in Q2, don't we? And absolutely, better late than never. Yeah. And and let us know which watch you have. Do you have a Galaxy Watch, an Active 1 or an Active 2? Let us know in the comments below and let us know yeah. what you like about them. Thank you for watching. <laughs>